Common mode voltage is created by VFDs switching IGBTs on-off continuously. This causes wear and tear on the motor bearings. The first sign of bearing damage is audible noise due to the bearing balls traveling over the pitted and frosted areas. How are these pitted and frosted areas created? Fast switching of the IGBT creates parasitic capacitances in the motor. Common mode voltage and capacitances are sources of a shaft voltage. Shaft voltage causes arcing through the bearing lubricant which results in pitting on the bearings and fluting on the bearing races. DVDT of the common mode voltage in the stator windings generates pulse currents flowing to the rotor. Part of this current flows between the inner race and the outer race of the bearings, causing heat in the lubricant. Common mode voltage generates an electric charge stored in the parasitic capacitance between the rotor and the stator. When this charge gets high enough, it breaks the dielectric insulation and is discharged through the insulation of the bearing. The capacitive discharge current can cause fretting of the bearing and raceways and produces temperatures high enough to melt the bearing steel and cause pitting. If the motor frame is poorly grounded and the motor is connected to a mechanical load that has a proper grounding, low impedance, the common mode current flows through the shaft reaching for the lower impedance. Clean power takes advantage of the latest generation of power transistors, advanced algorithms, and optimized integrated filters to produce the next generation of VFDs without common mode voltage. A clean power VFD is the solution. A three-phase clean power VFD produces three smooth sinusoidal waves, which at any point average a sum of zero. This creates an optimal scenario with zero common mode over voltage. The best solution to mitigate common mode voltage is to not generate it. A clean power VFD produces a clean signal with no need to mitigate common mode voltage. Visit smartd.tech to learn more.